what's up everybody this is Reese here from Seamanga and welcome to my review of Hunter x Hunter chapter 342 Ordinance so you know what this week here it was another friggin super long talkative chapter which kind of like you know obviously is building up to what's actually to come but seriously I'm really really happy that this series is back because I know good things are going to be happening soon it's just really slow and information overload at the moment so yeah um at the moment, obviously, the Zodiacs they're interrogating Beyond, trying to find out like what his true intentions are. Uh, same time, you got the V Five talking about like the dangers of the Dark Continent. So yeah, um, quite a lot of what they were talking about is pretty much like a recap of what Jin was saying to Gon top the friggin' World Tree thing. You know, like how obviously the land that they're in at the moment that's kind of like a safe haven in the middle of a uh, in the middle of the ocean of the Dark Continent. So they're in a safe spot. Whereas obviously, if they venture out, that's when they're gonna get into like the bad parts <laughs> so yeah what kind of surprised me the most about what they're talking about with the dark continent is just the survival rate of those who actually go to it i mean like at the what 7500 people i think they were saying who's actually done that voyage only 28 have returned alive and then to make it even worse is that out of those 28 only four have actually been able to kind of like return to their normal lives so yeah that is one messed up survival rate you know i think they said something like point four percent of people who go there actually come back in a proper like working state which is freaking crazy it's like what the hell why would you even want to go there um but yeah one thing which i did kind of like about this chat that i thought was pretty funny um was that obviously after all the really really long wordy parts here where they're kind of like talking about everything that's going on you obviously get the one character like what the hell are they talking about and they're like so to summarize it's like thank you lord because i would not have known what the hell is going on unless they did actually summarize it so yeah i think that was like kind of really funny so like obviously you know they're doing a whole long convoluted confusing way of saying what the hell's happening what the hell's going to be happening and stuff and then it's like cool summarize it up for those of like us who just kind of like ended up skimming through all the long words because like let's face it that was a hell of a lot to read <laughs> so yeah i'm actually really really looking forward to this arc starting off it's like i'm actually really interested to see like who the enemy is going to be of this um, kind of arc because obviously like you know at the beginning you got hasaki then obviously you had um the Oh god, what was their names? The spider dudes. Then you had like the video in the video game world, you had um the bomber dude, then obviously the chimera ants. So yeah, obviously there's been kinda of like a I don't know. Obviously also the chimera ant arc, that was kinda of like, you know, the pinnacle, the height of like enemies. I mean come on net the top Nitter he didn't even survive against them, so it's like you know, if those guys actually came over from the Dark Continent, what the hell are these guys going to be walking into? Like, how powerful the enemy is going to be? That is what I really want to see. So, obviously, you can end up seeing, like, all these, like, new characters being introduced. Like, these are supposed to be, like, top of the top. You can actually finally see how powerful these guys really are, which would be really, really nice. <laughs> so, yeah, um, one good thing was that, obviously, Jin, he's definitely going on this journey. He's, like, signed up to it and everything. Um, one kind of weird thing that I thought that was kind of weird I'm not sure whether it was translation that made it a little hard to understand that I read obviously um, he was talking about like sending 5,000 chimeras so I don't know what the hell he's talking about but like the first thing that jumped into my mind was obviously like talking about the chimera ants because obviously you have some of the chimera ants that have survived and obviously they've sworn to not eat humans anymore um, people are like what's that guy's name Cobalt I think that was his name uh, the weird parrot faced angel wing dude so yeah, obviously you got like all them guys there like are they gonna hopefully return and be a bit more part of the story because yeah it was, it'll be kind of nice to actually see like you know other people kind of coming into it and then you know obviously you've got the weird looking zodiacs what the hell are they they don't even look freaking human they're obviously taking on the forms of the freaking animals that they represent so you know they're kind of like not that far distinguishable from the chimera ants themselves so yeah it'll be kind of nice to see them all team up together working with the hunters and everything but yeah um this arc definitely definitely building up to something amazing cannot wait to see those dangers that are going to appear that are going to appear what are they going to face and yeah hopefully it's all going to be good so yeah this chapter like i was saying really really wordy but it's all building up to something which i know is going to be good so let's just hope that you know they're just getting out they're getting all the information just out in the open as quickly as possible so they can just carry on with like the good bits that we're waiting for so yeah um that pretty much ends it here for me guys uh i thought it was really wordy it's kind of like an average chapter a couple things obviously got introduced but not much but yeah it was all right you know so yeah um this is obviously part of the video where you guys tell me what you thought about this chapter you know let me know what you think and everything in the comments section below and as usual don't forget to check out the other stuff we do on the channel so i'll see you next time